I, I've got a uh, public service broadcasting video. Uh, it, this is I'm putting it out you know, broadly on YouTube. So if you're watching this, you're watching this. But it's mainly for handhold clients. So if you bought a property using our handhold service, uh, pay attention. Um, we get um, I, I get contacts like this regularly, and um, you know, I'm always usually a bit skeptical. Uh, let, me, let me put it that way. Um, there's a, a, a company we've been using, and you know, bear, bear in mind that. Uh, being part of the for the, for the landlord's family, part of the, for the team, uh, we like to think that we can introduce you to you know, a wider team of people, um, you know, solicitors, mortgage brokers, accountants, people that we use ourselves. We'd never recommend them to anybody unless we use them ourselves, um, and they'd be useful. So we are on the lookout for this, and these these kind of things come to us regularly, and uh, you know, honestly, nothing's really cut the mustard. Um, however, we gave this one a go, yeah, nothing to lose. I did it myself personally and um, a couple of weeks and it was weeks it was under a month uh, money started dropping to the bank account so um, yeah it works and I want to let everybody know and get out there and, and, and let, let's start putting some clients back through it um, we're talking about uh, reclaiming stamp duty uh, when you buy a property uh, there are well, first of all you, you will pay stamp duty the solicitor will fill in the form and you'll pay it and uh, solicitors are tax advisors of course and not only that if you start to have that conversation around you can we can we you know, mitigate the tax or whatever um, more often than not their compliance department will just shut it down and say no because we don't want to be liable and, and, and their compliance says you just got to pay it so it's not the case that you've you've overpaid you always meant to pay and then you then you can potentially claim it back um, it's just the way it is when you're dealing with solicitors um, so this company got in touch with us um, gave us a, a, a very nice format and um, yeah, process to go through um, like I say healthy set skepticism on on our behalf the team I said I'll, I'll give it a go on my property uploaded a, a couple of my own properties I've done recently uh, answered some simple questions uh, if you have a property that um, was bought but wasn't suitable to live in on day one and there's all sorts of sort of subsections and sub questions beneath that but most of the handhold properties that we buy probably wouldn't have been uh, suitable to live in so th th there's there um there's also some other questions you know annex buildings joint names um to limited company those, those movements um multiple dwellings in one transaction that might be a, a linked transaction fee that might not have needed to be paid uh, mixed use stuff deceased estate stuff all the, there's, there's a list of questions and there's a nice questionnaire that this company that we um, we're now happy to recommend uh, put together for us um, so if you fall into this category if you have recently bought a property and paid stamp duty that's everybody isn't it um, everybody's bought a property of course uh, click on the link in the description it'll take you to the page and, and, and we'll, we'll help you run through that and um, and, and, and hopefully we'll get some uh, some money back for some clients and re reclaim some SDLT it's, I, I'm starting to do it I've, I've done uh, um, yeah I think there's I think there's six that have come through in the last and we, we, we've been going at it it's uh, you know just under two months now so then there's a there's a healthy long list of stuff going through as well so you know looks like it's working no promises it's a good recommendation I'd, I'd, I'd say from experience they're a professional setup and they're working if you're a client of ours click on the link if you're not a client of ours there'll, there'll be another link on how to become a client let's stick let's stick that in as well but uh, you know i ho ho hope everybody's well and um yeah hopefully we can get some some money claimed back for some people out there bye for now